Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Uh, so today what I want to be showing you guys doing whatever is we're gonna unbox uh, Some more lit unicorn stuff. I got some more wigs. I'm jazzed on my hair has been growing out It's getting it's getting pretty decently long You know, it's getting there slowly but surely. I'm hoping that by the end of summer It's gonna be like about here, which I think it will be um which means that then I can start to like style it and then I think I'm gonna shave the sides down really tight and I've kind of got like this little like slightly mullet thing going on but you know I I am personally am a huge fan of like slightly trashy haircuts so that's what I'm gonna do with my real hair and then I've got my like classy wigs when I'm feeling like being a true lady, you know. Um, oh, I also got my nails done by one of my tattoo clients. He does amazing work. Let me get in closer here so you can see them. They are just freaking phenomenal. He kills it. So without further ado, let's just pop into this box, see what all the magical goodies I got and get into it. Hey guys, uh, just by the way, subscribe, like, comment, share if you feel like it, whatever, all that good stuff. There are links down in the description box below for every single wig that I show in this video. And if you click those, it'll take you right there. Uh, the nice thing is, is it is an affiliate link for me. So it's a way that you can help support my channel so I can continue to keep making content for you. And if you like the wig reviews and it inspired you enough to buy a wig, definitely please check that description box and click the link and then go check out their wigs. Cool, enjoy the video. So today I'm actually, as you might notice, I'm uh, not at home filming where I normally do film. I'm actually at an Airbnb. Uh, as you saw probably in my last video, I've been making a point of photographing myself for my OnlyFans. Um, and when I'm doing that, I'm doing it at Airbnb, so it looks like I have a different set every single time. And it looks just a little bit more refined and professional, which is what I want from my OnlyFans and what I want from my YouTube. So anyway, Airbnb today, woo! Um, so what I ordered from them is I got two different wigs. This is kind of like the standard box that they come in. Box thing. It's like a, like a rounded box, I don't know. So, as you can see, it's got the little unicorn dude thingy on it, and that good stuff. I decided to get some shorter ones because it's summertime, and I've also been contemplating a move to Arizona where it's going to be very hot, and the longer wigs can be kind of sweaty, and that's great in the wintertime, but in the summer it's a little too much. So I got two wigs. And then I also got some lashes. This set is, um, let's see, is there a name on here? Uh, Fox Me. So let me get it up in here so you can see it. And as you can tell, I'm not wearing lashes. I'm only gonna put one set on though because I'm doing, again, I'm photo shooting myself. Photo, photo, photographing myself, yeah. <laughs> today so and then I don't know this one also says fox me so I don't know let me grab my my thing those are the ones that I purchased uh, doesn't look like there is any oh. <sighs> guys I'm silly anyways <laughs> it says right here what I got so the, this one is eye candy and let me show it to you again because I'm not sure. I think I showed you this one, but I could be wrong. So this one I think is probably gonna be my favorite set because I have a little bit of hooded eyes, as you can tell. Um, really long lashes tend to look a little too caterpillary on me, just my personal taste, nothing against anybody in their choices for extra eyelashes because I'm all about that extra. Um, anyway, so I foxed is this one. Let me show it to you. This one might be a little bit along the little too thick for me lines and a little too long. Um, I think my two favorite pairs are probably the first one and then this one is stowed to dode. Right here. So yeah, those are the three lashes that I got from Lit Unicorns. So I just put on the eye candy, this guy right here and 
This is what they look like. And then, I also purchased a wig brush just because I uh, felt like maybe it would be beneficial. I don't really know. I've been brushing mine with a normal. This is really loud. I'm gonna. <laughs> they're so cute, but they're like totally immobilizing. <laughs> Anyway, so it's got like little loopies. This is one of their wig brushes off there. It was like, I think like five bucks. So I figured I'd give it a go, try it out, see if it's a little bit more gentle on my wigs because I feel like the normal hairbrush has been a little slightly rough, so. And then I also bought a wig stand. I got one off of Sheen as well and they were cheaper, but these honestly, the plastic seems just a little bit more sturdy on these ones. Not by much, but a little bit more sturdy. These I think were like, let me look. Oh, it doesn't tell me. It does not tell me my prices. Um, anyway, these I think were like seven, six bucks or something like that. And the other ones off of Sheen are like $4. So anyway, I bought some wig stands, but let's, let's, let's look at these. Because this is what I'm really here for. This is what you're really here for, let's be honest. My hands are struggling, guys. I'm struggling. Where is this? Oh, okay. It was, the net was like stuck to the clip inside of the wig. Okay. So this one I got is called a uh, Gumdrop Thought, I think. Thought, thought, Tatiana. Tatiana? Yeah. Gumdrop Thought. Thought. Thought, thought, thought. Yes. I thought it was thought. I thought. So this is one of the shorter ones. Um, you know, I already feel like it's gonna be fine because it doesn't have this like, um, I was worried that you'd be able to kind of see like the, the meshiness sort of on the head part, if that makes any sense what I'm trying to say. Um, it does come a little bit more crinkled, I would say, than my other wigs have, unfortunately. So I was kind of hoping that I could shoot in this one today, but I don't think I will be able to. Um, let's try it on, I suppose. Obviously, I need to cut the lace. Um, I think it's centered. Again, I'm filming in a different way than I normally do, so I don't really know, but it's a little shorter in the back, which is cute, I think. Um, yeah. <laughs> I can't see it, so I have no idea if it looks good. Hopefully it does. You guys will have to tell me. I'll find out when I uh, go to edit the video, I suppose. So that's that one. Obviously it's got like some little crinkies, crinkly wrinklies from being just freshly unboxed. So I'm gonna have to go through, like you can see right here too, it's really obvious. Um, I'll have to go through at home and see if I can straighten it or maybe I'll be able to kind of steam treat it in the shower while I'm here, hopefully, fingers crossed. Um, Cause I was looking forward to hopefully using this one for my photo shoot today. So. That was Gumdrop Thought. Thought, Tiana, Thought, Tiana. Whatever you'd like to say there. This one is Lime Crime. Ooh, right there. Lime Crime was the one that I've been thinking about the most, I'll be completely honest. Um, just because I used to have green hair, it was like a darker green, like a forest green, but here is that one. Let me make sure you guys can actually see it. It's pretty thick. I think it's, to me, it seems slightly thicker than the other one, which is nice. It's cute. It doesn't have as many bumps in it, so I can probably use it today, which is nice. I'm excited about that. And we will try it on and give it a right good go while I blind myself with this lace here. Hold on. I can't see. I think 
You got it? <laughs> Every time. <laughs> so that is this one. It's not tightened, so it might look a little funky in the back. But you can tell it's pretty thick. You can't really see like the mesh through it, which is nice. It's a good, like, solid amount of hair. This is the side if you care. Yeah. I'm gonna see if I can steam out. Okay, so now I'm trying to switch over to my vlogging lens and this thing is, it's big. It's, it's pretty, it's pretty bulky. So I'm doing my best, I promise. Um, this is my current filming setup that we're doing. Anyway, brief interlude. So I'm, as you can hear, running the shower in an attempt to hopefully be able to relax this wig enough. So we're running it on hot. Hopefully I don't need a warm shower later. <laughs> And I'm just going to try to find a spot that I can hook this up, hopefully, and it'll relax. Hopefully oh, she'll be good. I'm going to close this. So I bought two other wigs from her that I didn't do a YouTube review on. This one is Platinum POV. It's the 22 inch one on the website. Um, it's really long, super beautiful, really like full too. I mean like that's... That's a good bit of hair, for sure. Um, kind of see it this way too, like how much hair is there. Uh, these are synthetic wigs, so they're great. I don't know about heat treating. I'm still, I'm still kind of new to wigs, honestly. This has been the only brand I've tried, and they have not let me down. Um, actually, that's not true. I ordered one off of uh, Amazon, and it was kind of crappy. So anyway, um, you can see, like, I cut the lace more in a zigzaggy kind of pattern and that makes it blend a little bit better to your forehead especially if you're not gluing it down if you have sensitive baby skin like i do um the glue will probably make me break out because i have a slight adhesive allergy that i've developed so anyway you can kind of see too how realistic that part is in there so yes that's this one that i got from her and then i got one other wig this this wig, unfortunately, I think has been discontinued. Um, she might need some slight brushing. It's definitely a little bit more, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Like it tangles easier than the other one. It's not as soft. Um, but that is, let me back up here. Here's this one. I hope you guys can see that. I'll bring it up closer to you so you can see the color blends. So it starts out almost like a natural color up <laughs> too short um yeah this one is one of my favorites and i styled it to the side here we go there's the part i styled it to the side and i created my own part this one's so cute So this one you'll see like all the time on my Instagram. It's like my favorite. I realized I forgot to show you guys this one, so. Here she is. Also very cute. Nice and long. So we're gonna go try to see if Homegirl has relaxed yet. We can only really hope, you know? Uh, honey, have you relaxed yet, girl? Mm, you chill. I got closer. Are you chill? Are you chilled out yet? Still got some crinkly, wrinkly ponies. Oh, look at that. Um, so she's probably gonna have to get wet. Well, I've yet to have to wash a wig yet, so this is what we currently have. Um, I'm really just hoping that it's gonna be 
but it's gonna be okay. <laughs> guys well i hope you enjoyed this video uh please like comment subscribe all that good stuff i do basically lifestyle channel so you're gonna see more things that are just i don't know they're just me they're me what i'm doing with my life sometimes they're vloggy whatever the next video that's probably gonna come up is me getting my butt cheeks tattooed that's gonna be video number two i'm hoping fingers crossed that i can sit through all of it and get both cheeks completely finished tomorrow or tomorrow friday today is not going to make tomorrow Friday. Anyway, all right. Bye guys. Love you. Whatever. Good enough. It is good enough to me.